these sites, these sounds are not what you want to hear on a Sunday in February at Daytona International Speedway. No one in these pits, no cars, no drivers, but the rain. There's been a lot of it this week, and it's been a dark cloud hanging over this entire speed week. I just hate that for everybody that, you know, is works hard and spends a lot of money to comes here and you know the teams included but you know most of our fans and and you guys are just you know we want to be able to go we're as hungry to go as everybody else is and it's frustrating to not have the weather on your side. Four Daytona 500s have been shortened due to rain, most recently in 2009, but the other time the race was postponed due to bad weather was in 2012. Back in 2021, rain delayed the Daytona 500 by five hours before it finished after midnight. Some drivers passed the time by making pit stops for fuel outside of the track. Ah, you just came from the racetrack? Yeah, we're racing and whenever it stops raining, we're feeding the whole crew. With the green flag never even dropping today, though, these teams get another day to prepare before the biggest event of their season. The problem is they can't do much more to get ready. Our changes are locked in. Figured out what we were going to do after practice yesterday. Hey, this is how we're going to have the car, and then it just sits. You know, it just waits. So, and then I mean, we'll, and we already understand like the strategy of the race. Like we talk about that weeks in advance, and, and kind of have an idea of what we're going to do. Some things might change kind of on the fly, like when you pit, who you pit with. You know, just depending on situation stuff. But uh, the worst part is the sitting around side of it, right? Sitting around to do this this huge race and this big event. You know, you just want to get going. The waiting around, twiddling your thumbs, it stinks, but it's. Uh, part of our sport sometimes you get pretty good at it I've got to be here either way so I don't look at the weather you know I've I know my job is to race until the race is over then I get to go home so I try not to let it go into my mind and if I'm going to be here in a rain delay I try and find something fun I can do in the meantime and then uh, come race whenever time to race I hate it for NASCAR though because you know it's just a momentum killer for us because we really want to go out there and, and show everyone in the fans and watching on TV um, how great of a sport we are right now and, and sometimes Mother Nature just doesn't doesn't work in your, your advantage. And with rain continuing to be in the forecast the rest of tonight and in the morning, this track is going to be a lot of work to dry for this double header in Daytona tomorrow with the Xfinity race in the morning and the Daytona 500 scheduled to be at 4 p.m. on Fox. And even if Austin Dillon won't peak at the forecast, you bet your bottom dollar that NASCAR hopes the sun will come out tomorrow. In Daytona, Kelly Price, Fox High Sports.